For Neil Roach, founder and CEO of Grid Test Systems, compatibility problems are a major concern as many different electric vehicle models will need to be powered at units made by a long list of charging station companies. One of the challenges in the market is that there are many new companies bringing out charging stations and then there's many vehicle manufacturers coming out with EVs. Uh, the numbers are like 75 different companies building charging stations and about 60 new models. And they're all implementing this charging standard called SAE J1772. And because they're all implementing this uh, independently, uh, there are some compatibility problems. In fact, General Motors at a conference in December um, uh, talked about compatibility problems between electric vehicles and public charging stations uh, in the market. And they actually uh, said that there's a need for more testing, uh, for more compatibility testing to make sure that when someone gets a new electric vehicle and they drive up to a charging station, they can be sure that it's going to work every time and they're not going to have any compatibility problems with their vehicle and that charging station. The utility companies are looking at uh, charging stations and networks of charging stations and saying, how can we integrate our uh, advanced services such as demand response or load management with these charging networks? And so utilities are trying to evaluate uh, I guess smart chargers or smart EVSEs to see can we send them signals uh, such as pricing signals or demand response signals and turn down the load of the electric vehicle charging network. And so uh, utilities uh, are evaluating in their, in their labs today how are the charging networks going to integrate with their energy management networks.